New at midday, what's left of the beach sailboat that came ashore at East Ocean View during Hurricane Irene could be removed today. All right, you'll remember this happened with two people on board trying to outrun the storm. Then last Friday, the boat mysteriously burst into flames. 10 Your Sight's Andy Fox is live in Norfolk with the details of what's happening right now. And Andy, we see some heavy equipment there. Yeah, we see the heavy equipment only on 10 right here. In here right now is uh, Tim Mullane. He is with the American Marine Group. It's a local company. He didn't want to do an interview. He has offered at no cost to remove this boat, put it into a dumpster, which will be provided by the city, and then they'll take it away. It's going to cost the city nothing, probably around $1,000 to $2,000. But Tim Mullane's going to be doing that with American Marine Group. And with me <laughs> is a lady who really wants this whole thing to be over with. Yes, sir. I'm really happy to see this happening now. It's, it's, it's none too soon. Elizabeth Canary, tell me what life's been like. Well, besides the traffic and the smell is 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 Tim. It's awful. I don't know what it's the fuel. It's still, I don't know what it is, but you can smell you can smell it right now. That's right, right. Yeah. And right over here, we can get a picture of him. This is uh, Mr. Mullane. He's been very generous with his time. He does not want to do an interview. Hopefully, we'll talk him into it, Carrie, because what he is doing is just really fantastic. I mean, he is taking this away at no cost to the city. The owners, Michael Calabrese and Gina Sullivan, will basically owe a very little amount of money. And he's going to take this, going to, you know, get the earth mover here, dig into it, put it into a dumpster, and it will be hauled away. But this is what's going on here right now. American Marine Group, it's a local company. They have volunteered as a public service to clean up at no cost this. And look at her right here, Elizabeth <laughs> yeah. Canary. Yay! Yay! Thank you. Hey, the long saga, Carrie and Don, is finally coming to an end. And you're seeing it here only on 10. How about that? All right, lots of happy folks, just not a happy ending for that boat. Thanks very much, Andy Fox Live for us in Ocean View. You may remember Andy earlier confronted the co-owner of that boat, Michael Calabrese, about the fire. He claims it was intentionally set and was shocked when he was asked if he had anything to do with it. Calabrese says he gave the names of two possible suspects to police, but fire officials will not confirm whether they have any suspects.